Storm Tracker 7 weather is presented by Panhandle Cleaning and Restoration. Well, hey, good evening, Ohio Valley meteorologist Tyler Vanji here just to break down this weather as we move forward into your work week. What to expect? Well, we had uh, some unsettled weather for this afternoon, but that's all starting to push out here. Uh, for the current time being, we're down to a light rain temperature right around 50 degrees, feeling that cooler air. Definitely noticed it after that cold front ro rolled through after those thunderstorms. For the rest of the night, though, it's going to trend more quiet and dry moving forward. Partly cloudy skies for our night tonight, but like I said, temperatures dropping down into the 40s. A bit of a chill. Uh, it's not what we've been experiencing thus far. Now, here's a look at satellite and radar just showcasing that cold front. Starting to push off into Pennsylvania, but just to the west, we still have that occlusion, that big low pressure wrapping back around. These spotty rain showers are expected to move through as we head through your Monday, so just stay uh, weather aware. Definitely grab uh, an umbrella or download that Storm Track 7 weather app to keep your eyes on that radar. Now, here's a look at your peak winds that we observed for our day today. 40 miles per hour at your local Wheeling Airport seems to be the one to beat, but still nonetheless breezy conditions all with that thunderstorm collapsing and that cold front moving through for our day today. Moving forward though, uh, for our day today, we maxed out right around 79 degrees and it's going to be rather cold as we move forward. So definitely not going to be above that average as we head into your Monday to kickstart this work week. No record setting heat or chill. But tomorrow morning, expect your temperatures right around the lower 40s to kickstart that morning. Like I said, lack of cloud coverage and that new frontal system moving through. So a new air mass, it's going to be cool moving forward. Now tomorrow we'll max out right around 49 degrees. So we're not in for a big warm up as we kickstart this work week and scattered showers likely to plague us as we head through the later morning and continuing throughout your Monday. Now, speaking of rain, chances for rain will stay uh, dry Tuesday through your Thursday, but then Thursday night into your Friday, I am expecting precipitation to roll back through associated with our next frontal system. So likely to see some more precipitation once again. Now, here's a look at predictor just showcasing those thunderstorms pushing into Pennsylvania for the time being. We'll trend dry over the night tonight. Then we'll wake up to some cloud coverage rolling in from the west, all associated with that low. So we're not done with it just yet. This low pressure will bring some scattered showers, but it's more so going to pick up once we start to filter in that sunshine and heat off into the west. Scattered showers throughout the day for our Monday. It's not going to go anywhere anytime soon. And we're also going to experience those windy conditions that we had for our day today, although they'll start to taper out. I'm looking around 10 to 15 miles per hour as we finish through your Monday, but they could likely stick around even into your Tuesday. Now, here's a look at your seven day forecast. I'm definitely going to trend on the drier side as we head through this work week, Wednesday through Thursday, starting to influence some warmth back into the Ohio Valley, but then just in time.